hungry. Hey, it's Jada Montemorano and I'm running on empty. Let's go. Stirring up this pot of sizzling pork in a food truck in Los Angeles is not where Raina Vasquez, owner of Hot Tacos, thought she would ever be with the ability to serve her mother's recipe next to her sister and co-owner Maritza. My mom taught us how to cook, how to make everything that we know now. It all began in Veracruz, Mexico, the sisters growing up in their mother's small home kitchen. But their move to Austin, Texas in the late 90s was a fresh start to hopefully follow their American dream. We started with nothing, basically. Uh, we didn't have any savings or anything. Um, but um, we started from the scratch. Yes. Basically. Yes, we started very small. Um, but honestly, it was because we really want to do something, you know, here. And we c came to this country with nothing, and we really wanted, and you know, do our best to succeed and to have a better life. And boy, did they succeed. The sisters opened Veracruz All Natural 13 years ago, expanding to six locations while often topping the best breakfast taco lists in Austin. Well, now you can find them right here in Los Angeles with hot tacos. All the work that we put for many years paid off. The truck in the parking lot of the Line Hotel in Koreatown may have different branding, which was just a fun idea for Reina and Maritza. The tacos was good also because it's a business, you know, run by women. And also the colors we use, you know, and our sauces are spicy. But the heart and soul of Veracruz is still deep within. Raina saying this move was a big deal for her family and team as a way to celebrate their culture and cuisine in a new place. We are Mexicans and, and, and we feel like LA has a lot of Mexican, Mexican culture, so we wanted to be part of it. They only plan on being part of it for about six months and then they'll reevaluate, possibly opening a brick and mortar in LA. And if it's any indication on creating a permanent home here, the truck was slammed and they haven't even had their grand opening yet. We're hoping to stay. And what brings the crowds here and in Austin are the famous Migas breakfast tacos. When they first opened over a decade ago, breakfast tacos weren't synonymous with Austin just yet, but they were something Reina and Maritza always ate growing up in Veracruz. Migas is, uh, it's been played to leftovers because in Mexico whatever you have left from dinner the day before that's what what you use to make a mega taco in the morning but these tacos are far from leftovers the sisters keep the full recipe under lock and key but just know they're made with homemade tortilla chips fresh vegetables and egg and all the toppings including bacon fresh ingredients organic and all natural for the LA audience, they did change their menu a bit to offer some vegetarian and vegan friendly options, like this cauliflower pastor taco. Still tastes really good, you know, for those people who don't eat meat. It's an honor to have this Austin staple in Los Angeles, so stop by Hot Tacos before it's too late. Austin has been on the top of my foodie bucket list and I haven't been able to get there yet, so I am so excited that the breakfast tacos are now coming to us. I have been waiting so long for this moment.